Hello you guys and thank you for coming back to the very next chapter of the adventure of Deacon and let's uh, do this Move along, buddy. Move hey, along. A bit way before like... we uh, do so any did. further action I would like Corporal. to Hey man, I saw you ride out with the Wizard Island Witch the other day Be sure. How'd that go? You mean Lieutenant Whitaker, Sergeant? Oh hey, no, I I didn't mean nothing. Corporal, see ya. Okay. Hey, uh, Corporal, what's happening? Where, where's my mic Sorry. anyway? I don't wanna. I'll, never mind. I'll run by. I'll run on foot anyway. It's near anyway. Taylor, what's going on? Man, can you believe this shit? Fucking Captain Curry's got me on guard duty. Like something's gonna happen to the dock in the middle of all this. Yeah, it's a tough job, but I'm sure you got it covered. All right. Yeah, yeah. Hey, what's going on with you, man? You got some uh, some saddle sores or something? Need a doctor to lube you all up? How's the ear? What? I can't hear you. <laughs> I'm just fucking with you, man. I'm feeling no pain, brother. Doc's got me on some oxy. Shit, it's tight. Wait. I'm fine. Okay, we're still recording. <laughs> I'm fine. I'm fine. <sighs> oh, hey. Uh, I saw the lieutenant earlier. She was trying to get something from the doc. Yeah. Yeah, I thought you'd want to know. Alright, well, thanks. See you around, Taylor. Yeah, man. Está as bien. You'll be fine. Just don't start any bar fights. <laughs> no promises, Doc. <laughs> you know, me parece. It's, I was thinking it's been a while since I've been in the shit. I'm getting soft. Me estoy ablandando. <laughs> Are you kidding? Oh. You're serious? You want to go on a run with me? I used to ride myself before the world went to hell, you know. All right, well, let's go. Corporal? Doc? Going someplace? Coronel, it's been a while since I've been on a run. I was going to go oh, and go no, 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 no. I don't think so. Oh, he's mean. Coronel? No, no I don't know what I'd do if I lost you. If anything were to happen to you, you can't be replaced. This Sir, I can... No, he's got a point. Dismissed, Corporal. Matt, I've been out in the shit before. I understand. But again, if anything were to happen to you, I I don't know what I'd do if I I don't know what I'd do if I lost you. Wait. Uh did you guys take a look at the face, the expression on the face of Deacon? <clears throat> I wonder, is there anything suspicious about the relationship between uh, Connor and that doctor? My brothers and sisters in arms, the, uh, Connor I speech. stand here before you in uh. celebration. The end is nigh. Yeah. Captain Curry has been working non-stop assembling and training our army. Lieutenant Whitaker has been working tirelessly on a biological weapon that will allow us to kill hundreds of freaks at once. Lieutenant Weaver is working on a chemical a fucking weapon bomb, just that will allow us to burn down entire hordes. Soon, slash and burn will be a thing of the past. We will go from fighting a defensive war right. yeah, to yeah, an yeah. offensive yeah. war as we take the fight to the freaks. As we work to retake our world, and behold, is that everything? Oh, she yes. said, "The enemy who sowed them is the devil, and the harvest is the end of the age, and the angry. reapers are angels, and they will gather out of his kingdom all evil yeah. and throw them into the furnace of fire." In that place, there will be weeping and wailing and gnashing of teeth. We, the Deschutes County Militia, are those avenging angels. And we are coming. Company. I mean, I am a god person too, but this is too much. Throw him into a furnace. Wow, I got money from listening to that speech. Their trust increase. Wow! 
Nice. Wait, what are we doing now? Now we go to that spot again. It's a different spot now. Uh, I believe this is Sarah's tent, sure. Well, that's it. That's as far as I can go. How can I help? You can't, unless you have a DNA synthesizer somewhere. No, but uh, there's an auto parts store near Fort Klamath that Dude, I could check out. You can't get what I need there. You. How do you think I would learn? I actually think I know where you can get one. Really? Yeah, your old lab, Cloverdale. Okay, yeah, that's great. All we have to do is find a way over the mountains. Yeah, you're right. That would be impossible. Oh my God, you know a way over, don't you? Good, you can take me. Is that an order, Lieutenant? Yes. No, I'm just... I mean, no, it's not an no, order. which is it? Oh, well, I don't know. Are you going to take me or not? Dress warm, pack light. Dress warm, pack light. Hey, Deke. Oh, my God. If you say thank you one more time, I... Whoa. This is definitely better than thank you. <laughs> Let me know when you're ready to go. Going somewhere, Lieutenant? Colonel? Captain? Yes, we're heading out to retrieve... The Curry is here, too. I see. How's your work progressing? Good. Good. With Deke Corporal St. John's help, I've been able to make some good progress. Thank you for assigning him to my project. Well, Lieutenant Weaver's also been making progress. He says he'll be ready to test his chemical weapon by the end of the week. I heard. Mine will be ready soon. You realize you are more valuable than any piece of equipment. Equipment can be replaced. You cannot. I've been in the ship before, Matt. You know that I can handle myself. Uh... Well, she just calls... Carol, okay. She calls him Matt. Like, they are really close, you know. I'm not sure if there is anything behind this. Uh, maybe they just closed, nothing else. Good. Uh, <clears throat> Yo, brah. What kept, what kept me going? Why is that all about, anyway? And pass with Sarah. All the yes sirs and no sirs and the saluting and the ranks and the uniforms just seems kind of pointless, you know? Considering. Hey, you were in the army once, you should know. That was different. How? Well, there were more people in the world, I don't know, I mean... Having a military made more sense. I think it makes more sense now. Why? It's utter fucking chaos out here. We need the order and discipline or we're not gonna make it. You know, I've been at plenty of camps that are doing just fine without having a colonel breathing down their necks. You know what's funny? About uniforms and ranks sitting pointless, I mean? No, oh, what? I used to think the same thing about the MC. I mean, you guys had ranks like road captain and president. I mean, you wore badges and patches and, and tats like uniforms. And when you guys used to all ride together, you looked like an army. Well, except for beers and bikes. Now that you mention it, I, I can see your point. You know, I'm actually surprised you weren't wearing the cut when you came into the camp. I don't think anything would make you give that up. Even the end of the world. Okay, so my cut, huh? We're gonna have to see if the colonel will let me switch uniforms. You know, there is that. Where are we heading? Diamond Lake. It's an old forest service road that winds around the western base of Mount Tielsen. Okay. Was that here when you came over the pass? Yes. Yeah, but the soldiers stationed there were having a bear problems. Bear problems? How they were fighting hey. a bear, I remember. Hey! Shut it off! You're gonna have to turn around, buddy. We got orders to keep anyone from... To keep anyone from what, Corporal? I'm sorry, ma'am. I didn't see it was you. It's, it's the Colonel, ma'am. He's given us orders to keep an eye out for anyone going AWOL. Are you accusing me of going AWOL? No, ma'am. Then get out of my way. Corporal, what are you still doing there? Get the hell out of my way. Yes, ma'am. I'm sorry, ma'am. I'll have to report this. Yeah, you do that. Well, that sounds serious. What do you mean? 
Well, he said he's gonna report you. I mean, how's Matt gonna take that? The Colonel will tell him to mind his own fucking business and to never question an officer. Yeah. He can also notice oh that my God. she called Drop. him Matt. Nothing, it's just... I mean, Matt. the view up here, it, it's incredible. Uh, yeah. I guess I just don't see it anymore. Uh, it is incredible. Pay attention to it, I mean. How can you not? It's it's breathtaking. Yeah, the world wakes up, grateful for another dawn. Hey, if you spent all day staring into a microscope, you might appreciate it more. Oh, I appreciate it. You know, being around when the morning comes up is a hell of a lot better than the alternative. I gotta be honest. You know, there were times when I didn't believe that. About, you know, hoping to see another day. Yeah, I know the feeling. What kept you going? I mean, back then. Uh, I, I don't know. Just, uh, too goddamn stubborn to give up, I think. I don't believe you. I did give up, Sarah. I did. And then, I, I don't know. Boozer's arm got fucked up. And I had to, I, I, I mean, I wasn't going to let him die, you know? So, watching him struggle to keep going when he had no reason, no fucking reason at all. I guess I didn't want to... I didn't want to let him down, so I, I didn't want to go out that way. And then I found out that that you were still alive in that. That's that's wow. when I really wanted to. Look at all this. That's when I really wanted to kill myself. <laughs> yeah, right. No, seriously. But uh, then I remembered you still had my mongrel's ring. And that's that's what kept me going. Figured I'd look you up, get it back. You know how that turned out. Shit. Exactly. Things are gonna get better, you know that, right? Yeah. Yeah. We can win this thing, Deacon. We can. Are you trying to convince me or you? We must be getting close, right? Yeah, we're coming up on the Tielsen Tunnel. Tielsen Tunnel. Why? Yeah, we've been here. I'm not sure. I'm just not sure that we're going the same way that we uh, went here first time with uh, uh, Iron Mike. If you remember. We need your help to move that out of the way. My God, what the hell is that? That is a sigil. It's a warning sign from the Rippers. What's a Ripper? Rippers. Rest in peace. They were a cult. They cut themselves. They worshipped the freaks. They wanted to be like them. And, um, <laughs> you could see what happened if you didn't want to be like them. How do we deal with them if we run into them? We ain't gonna run into them. Because <laughs> we killed them all. Or what? Because we have killed them all. <laughs> we killed Carlos, we killed the whole, you know, Ripper shit uh, right <laughs> off with, to Cloverdale. What the fuck that is? What the fuck that is? I mean, uh, oh, we, uh, okay, we, uh, okay, now we, I guess we're trying to squeeze our ass into that narrow path. Come on. Hurry up, wife. Okay, hang on. This is gonna be a tight squeeze. Jesus. No wonder everyone gave up their cars. This is nothing. There's a tunnel up in the old Belknap Road that Boozer and I rode through all the time. Traffic had been backed up at a Nero checkpoint for about a mile when everything got overrun. Sounds horrible. I seem worse, but yeah. I think we're finally hey, getting familiar. Yeah, we have, yeah, it's right we up got, here. Finally got back to the you know uh, the north. And this is a place I remember in the uh, the vision in the past of uh, Deacon. This is. Uh, I thought I'd see this place again. Yeah, this is the place that Deacon and Zara used to go. She used to work here. Okay. All right. Power's still on. Yeah, it doesn't surprise me. 
There's a solar array on the main rooftop. I think I also heard rumors about a nuclear powered generator, but I never saw it. Okay, well, how the hell are we gonna get in? Yeah, I'll show you. Like you said, power is still on, right? Sarah Irene Whitaker, ID 2007659. Well, you guys are a little more high tech than I remember. <laughs> it's not really that impressive. Aerie's not intelligent. She's like a souped up smartphone app. Aerie? Artificial intelligence response interface. <clears throat> oh my god. What is it? Nothing. It's. <laughs> This, there's so much food here. Sarah, this should be. It, it, it's the, the irrigation system. It's all self automated. So as long as the power's on, this is self sustaining. Oh, wow. Well, shit. This place has everything. It's got food. It's got water. It's got power. It's got a big fucking fence. I'm surprised no one is uh, camped out here. Well, it's like you said, the power is still on. That's 8,000 volts telling everyone to keep the fuck out. <sighs> See? Come on. That uh, electric, uh, electric uh, fence might you somewhere. Yeah. Oh. oh fuck! A thousand volts. <laughs> you die immediately when you touch that. <laughs> I think these are infected, uh, these are no normal, you know, crowds, they are infected. Uh. Oh. Lots of cuts. God crows. God damn crows. Crows. They're infected. Uh, yes, they are. It's just said that. them so hyper-aggressive. That makes them a pain in my ass. I think we should be okay as long as we're quiet. Okay. Come on. Right. <laughs> okay, uh, the point is, uh, you gotta be quiet. <laughs> Got it. What, what the hell fuck? happened here? I don't know. Oh, it's a dry body. Dry corpses. Dry corpses. A lot. Uh, not sure if they're just corpses or freakers. Sarah. But, oh, oh, fuck. These, uh, these people all worked here, right? Did you know them? Oh my yeah. god, they have all dried out from yeah, a very long time ago. Since a very long time ago. Let's go, come on. <sighs> Maybe someone. Might have shot them. So someone oh. shot them all. <laughs> I just I said that. What? Trying to leave. I mean, yeah, it looks like it. And then they just locked the place up tight and they left. Why would they do that? I don't know, Dan. I don't know. I wasn't here. Well, it's like I have the ability to predict, predict the, um, you know, the dialogue. But I swear I don't know anything about the dialogue. It's Sarah, I, I didn't know anything about the dialogue. Just uh, my lucky Shit. guess. This one's not working. Swear. Come on, there's another one over here. What was Sarah? So okay, so why is um, what'd you call it, Airy? Why is Airy working at the front gate and not the front door? Honestly, I'm surprised she's working at all. I remember the guys in the IT department constantly complaining about the system going down, and th that was with weekly maintenance. <laughs> now it's been what two years? All right, in a couple of hours to come. Uh, I gotta work. <laughs> just, just 
Just saying, just telling you. Oh, this is large. Damn it, I, I don't understand why these aren't working. Yes, hey, sir. What? You know how you said that no one could get in here? Yeah? Why? Maybe they're already here. Motherfucker. My god, you're right. They've locked me out. Hey! Hey, let us in! We're not here to hurt you, and we're not here to stay! Oh, god, let us in! Oh, is there another way in? Yeah. Yeah, I've got an idea. Come on. Alright. There's a fire escape in the back of Call the warehouse. Why won't they have that locked out too? We don't know that they've locked out anything. I mean, it's probably just a glitch. The emergency exits can't be locked out. They're part of Cloverdale's safety protocols. <laughs> Look at the cornfield. Nice. Here, this is it. I just have to figure out how to get up there. Hold on, hold on. Uh, I can shoot the latch. Damn it! Good shot. You done that before? Yeah, once or twice. there <sighs> I don't know about this why don't you let me go in first I don't know what happened back there in the parking lot but I'm telling you there's no way anyone could have gotten in past this fence I know these people and if Jim's in there he's gonna Jim, let us in Jim Jim the rent -a cop Jim <sighs> Jim who almost shot me when I tried to pick you Deacon, up that was so long ago and a lot's changed since then <sighs> yeah not for the better Sarah Irene Whitaker ID 2007659 See, I told you. Those other doors must have been bugged or something. Ready? Get down. Mother of fuck. You were saying? Yeah. Well, this won't stop anything. Trust no one. Expect the worst. I'm beginning to see your point on that. Alert. Stay up here, give me cover. Fuck. Do whatever you can. This is right. Got it. I'll see you when it's clear. Where the fuck are they anyway? Will you shoot those goddamn speakers? Your voice is driving me fucking crazy. I'm with you there. Warning. Deadly force. Is hey, you! Look whoever's shooting! Stop! Is clear. Coming. ID 2007659. Sarah Irene Whitaker. Security has been breached. Security the Cloverdale facility the is in lockdown. Repeat. Override. ID 2007659. Override. Security protocol Alpha 761 has been overridden. Warning. 
He must not have locked out inner security. Warning. You ready? Yeah, this time? Let me go in first. Hey, this time? We go in together. Good intro. How okay, was that? Alert. Alert. 911. Shit. Snipers up there on the roof. Stand down and you will not be caught. Where, where's my wife? Oh, what the fuck are you shooting at? Move down, please. One more time. Sarah Irene Wolf, two zero zero seven six five nine. Security override and disable the fucking voice response. Warning. Deadly force is what? authorized. Ready? Yeah. They call her. Tim, wait! That son of a bitch! Alert. Well, Alert. what's it say? Nine one one has been called. Police are on it. Will not be harmed. Let's make sure it's clear. <clears throat> yeah, on it. You're seeing. Alert. It's clear in here. Alert. This is a level four alarm. Clear. Same here. Warning. Deadly force is authorized for you. Warning. Deadly force is authorized. Wait. Where is this place? More ammo. Oh. This is the guy that shot okay, us. It's clear. While we were crossing the bridge. Alert. Alert. Come on, let's try the door. Sarah Irene Whitaker, ID 200759, security override and disable the fucking voice response. Access denied. Sarah Alert. Irene Whitaker, Alert. your this security clearance has been alarm. revoked. Multiple shots Please have see an IT administrator security for assistance. To the maintenance building. You fucking bitch! Hey, hey, going in that way would have been a death trap anyway. Every gun on the other side of that door is aimed right here. We need a better plan. Warning. Deadly force oh, yeah, is authorized for use against oh, well, all maybe? trespassers. Uh, like, Deadly is there a way to that rooftop from here? Over here. Uh, this is a lot I took before. Yeah, now we, we There's go. a ledge out here. You should be able to climb up to the roof from that AC Alert. Unit. Alert. You mean you should be able to climb up from there? Listen, I want you to go up there, lay down suppressing fire, keep their attention. When they're all looking up, I'm gonna go in from here, I'm gonna take them by surprise. Okay, that's a really good plan. But uh, there's, uh, there's one problem with it. Alert. Alert. What's that? This is a level four the door's alarm. locked up. Multiple Alert. shots have been fired. Oh, Security come on, to the come on, I have an idea. Building. What? Put your hand Deadly on that reader. Is authorized. Wait, what are you doing? Yes, I'm in. Okay, they locked out security, but they forgot the admin codes. From this station, I can get you a temporary access code. Alert. All right, here's Alert. your ID code. Ready? Has been uh, yeah. Police are your full name and ID 5429009. Got that? Uh, 5429009. Uh, is that right? Yeah, let's go. Alert. Alert. This is a level four alarm. Multiple shots have been fired. Security personnel to the maintenance building. Here. I'm gonna need you to help me up. Okay, hold on. Warning. Deadly force is authorized for use against all trespassers. Warning. Deadly force is authorized. <laughs> Ready? Alert. Yep. <clears throat> you got it? Yeah. Wait until I get their attention, then you go in. Hey, don't take any chances. 
you kidding me? These days, that's all I do. Alert. Alert. Okay. This is Go. level four alarm. Multiple shots. Use every code to enter. Security personnel to the maintenance building. <laughs> Deacon Lee St. John, ID 54290 I shouldn't have tanked them all like that. Just uh, should have Alert. taken cover. This is at level four alarm. Multiple shots have been fired. Security person activated. Oh. Deacon Lee Saint John. ID 542900. Tell your men to stand down. Deacon Lee Saint John. Welcome to Overdale Fire and Facility. This is your first call. Please. Disable voice Come on. Get her. Damn it, Shiva, listen to me. Come on. Here we go. Oh, the hell with you. Shiva, you have the chance. Alert. 911 has been called. Police are on their way. Stand down and you will not be harmed. Tell me what you want. Okay. All right. He's clean! We were just defending ourselves. Get down there. All the dead people outside, Jim. You know, the ones you shot in the head? I don't know what you're talking about. I mean, what was it, huh? What were they trying to do? Get home to their families, maybe bring them back here. But you didn't want that, did you? We just couldn't take the risk. Get up. Wait, wait, wait. I can't. Don't make me. Jim, I'm gonna count to three. No, 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 no. One. You don't understand. Two. Look, don't do this. Three. Open the goddamn door. All right, all right. I hope 
you know what you're doing. Thank you, Jim. Yes, we know what we're doing. You don't have to do this. Let me go. I'm sorry. We just can't take the risk. She gonna Holy. Come on. I wanna get the hell out of here. I mean, uh, she's right to do that because because that because that guy could turn on us anytime soon. But uh, I was shocking. Oh, that was shocking. It's all true. I didn't want to believe it. Like what? What are you talking about? This is my fault. What? I, I don't understand. You should have seen it when it first went in. I mean, we used to grow wild ginger and, and grape root here. And then all of this changed. They sealed everything off. They took away my clearance. God, David kept telling me. He kept telling me that something was wrong. Okay, okay. Who's, who's David? So David Gorman. He was this research intern. You know what I said? I told him that we're a farm and we're, we're high tech and all that shit and that there are billions of dollars at stake and to just leave it alone. Then he didn't listen. He hacked the system, he got behind the firewall, he told me that this was some sort of classified project or something. I don't classified know. project, just he slow wanted, down and... He wanted to be the next Edward Snowden. You see, he wanted to blow the lid off of this entire thing. David Gorman... He exposes the evil empire and saves the world and all that shit and I didn't listen to him Deacon I told him that he was being paranoid and he must have broken in here and then gotten some sample of whatever the hell they were cooking in here well, I don't understand what do you mean I pieced it together in myself a little while later the night that I was stabbed I, I went to the Cloverdale office in farewell and I went to, to go try and find David but he was already gone He'd been gone for two weeks. There was this big green expo in Portland. He must have gone to see a reporter. He was probably infected and he didn't even know it yet. Oh my God. And two days later, two days later, everybody at that conference was infected and then they all got on planes and they went home. And a week later, two and a half billion people were dead. Sarah, this isn't, this couldn't be your fault. I mean, you couldn't have stopped it. You How don't could you understand. Have stopped? It's, it's the research. My research was a part of this. Deacon, I was a part of this. They, they used me. <laughs> Uh, the electric fences, how would I turn them off? Uh, the power relays are in a building by the greenhouse is why. Okay, um, it's just that there's a lot of food here, and I was thinking about radioing Boozer, letting him and Ricky know, letting Lost Lake Camp know. Mm. You think you could? Yeah, sure. Okay, um, I'm gonna be right there. Okay. Gonna take a risk. Turn off the Cloverdale's electric fences. Uh, I'll go that way. I wouldn't encounter any, you know, freakers or something. Yeah. Power building. Yeah, that's uh, it's gotta be. It. Oh no. Crow. Are we about to encounter the crows? Oh shit! Knew it. On the tops needed. Burn the crier nests. What the fuck you? Oh really? Come on, there you. Get 
gonna sprint drift sprint gonna sprint drift faster of all these guys can't see the nest Somewhere there. Oh no, come on. I think we're really close to the nest that way there. Is that it? Because I don't I, I don't know. Almost got hit by that one, <laughs> but it flew right into my shot. So. Fuck you! Now that I have cleared uh, some of them out, so just uh, I'm just gonna run to the spawn. It's it was right here the whole time. The nest. Why is it all one? Because there is two of them. As you can see now, the crows are gone. At this area, of course. But uh, where is the other one? Must be right on this tree right here. It looks like so. I don't know. Okay, so. Electric fences. No, I just gotta jimmy that door. <laughs> not now, not now. Got it. I gotta craft more. I can't craft. Craft bandage. Uh, I already got a lot of materials. Such a bike, we couldn't take the risk. Uh Boozer, it's it's Deacon. Come back. Lost Lake Camp, is anyone there? Deacon? Deacon, is that you? Yeah, Boozer, it's me. Hey, it is good to hear from you, brother. Good to hear from you too. Listen, I don't I got a lot of time. Uh the the research facility that Sarah used to work at, the one near Iron Butte, the one near the river, you know the one that I'm talking about, right? So listen, there's food here. Lots of food, corn, so tell Ricky, tell Iron Mike, tell him to send someone. Wait, you found her? What you found Sarah? Yeah, I found her. Booz man, I found her. That is <laughs> awesome, Dick! When are you bringing her back? What to Lost Lake? No. I'm not gonna get into that right now. D? Yeah. Tell her. Tell her. You can be safe, okay? Be safe. Boozer. Boozer, Boozer. Lost Lake Camp, come in. Come in. Ricky. Okay, good. Listen up. Uh, Dee? Yeah, yeah, it's me. Uh, listen, there's a... I don't think we'd hear from you again. Iron Mike said you weren't coming back. Uh, look, I don't have a lot of time. Listen, there's this... Did you find her? Yeah, yeah, I found her. Ricky? I'm glad, Dee. You were right. We made it. I'm glad 
she did too. Why every time she? Why? Why does she every time? Yeah. Okay. Listen. There's this farm. Okay. Uh, there's a uh, power. It's got electrical fences. Electric fences, Captain. And if you come here, it, ask Boozer. It's where Sarah used to work. Uh, by Iron Butte. He's gonna know the place. You come over here. You're gonna find food. You're gonna find lots of food. <sighs> okay. Oh, how's he doing? Oh, um, good. Good. You'll never believe who Iron Mike made head of security. Are you kidding? <laughs> wow, that's great. Um. Could you tell? You know what? Listen, I gotta go, Ricky. But uh, you know what? Wait a second. Wait a second. Wait a second. Ah, uh, that thing you said about uh, lighting a candle. I think maybe you were right. I know. Yeah. What is the name of candle? What? About... <laughs> I forgot, man. Yeah, I remember that. I recall that. Ricky said something about candle. But... Saint John, this is Curry. I don't know what it was. Where are you? My men reported that you went through his checkpoint at the Kielsen Pass. Yeah, Captain. Uh, there's a research facility in Iron Butte. It's uh, it's like Sarah, uh, Lieutenant Whitaker said, there's an important piece of equipment that she needed. And this is where... And this was the only place that she could get it. She's not answering her radio. The Colonel wants to know why you're not back yet. Tell him, uh, tell him we're on our way. The Colonel wants to speak to you. Sorry, Captain, you're breaking up. Uh, heading out right now. St. John out. Uh, if you pay attention, um... Did, uh, you talk to him? To Boozer? Yeah. Yeah, yeah, I told him that you're fine and we're fine and... That I uh, had to get moving because we have to try to make it over the pass before the weather turns. What do you think? I don't know. It doesn't look good. But it's worth a try, so uh, let's get moving. When uh, Boozer and Ricky asked about uh, uh, Sarah, um, as um, Dick said, I found her, he lowered his voice, if you pay attention, uh, I don't know why. And I feel really sorry for Ricky. I think she fell in love with uh, Deke. At first I thought that she was gay, but I don't think she is. Since uh, she had shown some affection for no, Deke. Or... Hey, you gonna come out and eat something? Yeah, just a second. Everything I had is soaking wet. Not sure if they're gonna sleep together again. Yeah, it is uh, such a case like this. Fuck, I'm hungry. I never thought I'd get warm again. Yeah. <clears throat> um, did you want to eat something or? Sure, if uh, Dick is uh, Dick looks like he's about th 35 in this game, and I hope I'll be that handsome in in my 35. Yeah. At my 35.
can't believe it. I am 29 by now. Give uh, a stamina boost and increase the rate of stamina regeneration. <coughs> he saw that. And now he's gonna question, he's gonna interrogate Deacon about their relationship. Maybe he's gonna guess out that she has been his wife the whole time. What's up? What's up with you? Okay, let's upgrade our skills. Uh, I'd like to upgrade my. I don't. Oh my god, this is almost full and. Uh, but how about I make it full? Um, maybe there is some hidden function behind this. Okay. Nothing at all. See, this uh, range combat pattern, I have uh, fully uh, upgraded the skills and nothing happened. I thought there'd be uh, some hidden, you know, uh, abilities or something. But there's nothing. St. John, come in. This is Corporal St. John. Uh, what's up, Captain? I need you to head back to command. Stat. Meet me at the infirmary. The infirmary? What's wrong? There's been an incident. I'm on my way. Okay, what the hell? Uh, <laughs> Lieutenant Whitaker, uh, are you there? Sarah? Come in, Sarah. <laughs> oh, God damn it. In front of where is it? That way. Okay, we got a problem. He has. Curry has found out the relationship of uh, Beacon and Sarah. And. What's going on? Captain? Dr. Jimenez has been murdered. Oh, man. And the son of a bitch. Jesus Christ. Slit his throat from here to Where's here. Where's Taylor? Did, did Taylor see anything? All the narcotics in the camp are gone. Taylor. This one's on me. I assigned him to the infirmary. Mm, well, that's not what I'm saying. I'm saying Taylor was a junkie. You knew? It doesn't matter. Wait, did Taylor kill them all? That funny guy? Alright, whatever that is, uh, we'll wrap up this episode right now. Thank you for watching, guys. Subscribe to my YouTube channel for better contents because I am way too hungry right now. I would like to, uh, I would like to make this uh, gameplay longer, but I'm way too hungry right now. See you next. Goodbye.